From United Nations Television, this is UN in Action. Just inland from Colombia's Caribbean coast lies a unique community. A network of wooden houses on stilts rises from the water, offering shelter to 2,000 residents. Here in Nueva Venecia, or New Venice, people depend on the surrounding water for every aspect of daily life. Perhaps no community needs high water quality more than this tiny fishing village. Gregorio Suarez has lived here his whole life. The higher the water quality, the better the fish production is. If you increase the production, there is more stability. Yet pollution threatens these waters. Marine traffic leaves behind toxic byproducts. Heavy metals used in mining flow downstream and settle in the ocean. Garbage piles up. Pesticides and fertilizer harm coastal and fresh water. Over the last five years, the International Atomic Energy Agency, IAEA, has supported 12 Caribbean countries to study their pollution problems. By using nuclear techniques, scientists uncover traces and types of pollution that settle in the seabed. The Institute of Marine and Coastal Research, INVAMAR, was one participant in the project. Luisa Fernanda Espinosa Diaz from INVAMAR. The population benefits because if we understand that certain processes are damaging our oceans, we can implement control measures that raise the quality of life for our people. To conduct their research, scientists carefully map areas of the ocean to measure possible pollution. Much like tree rings tell the history of a tree, scientists use nuclear techniques to retrace pollution's origin. By extracting a sample from the ocean floor, this plastic tube becomes a time capsule. Juan Pablo Parra of Invamar explains further. This sediment sample will be transported to the lab, where we can identify sources of pollution and make a historical construction of the contamination. The Colombia team found significant contamination of mercury left over from mining operations. The discovery of mercury buried deep in the seabed is vital in helping Colombia design a new approach to future marine operations, ensuring that these harmful elements don't rise and threaten surface water. By tracing the pollution of the past and sharing experts, equipment, and knowledge throughout the region, IAEA helps countries plan for cleaner water and safe marine resources for tomorrow. For people in Nueva Venecia, nuclear techniques are bringing a clean and promising future. This report was produced by Dana Sacchetti for the United Nations.